Hey there guys, Sickle Make Mango here for a uh, trap spotlight. Oh, free cake inside. I just woke up. For cake pull lever. It's pistons, is give me cake? Oh, look! Cake! Oh. Oh. I just want to take as much cake as I can. Oh, no! No! I'm sure if you can make cake out of lava, this is what it would taste like. So basically, what this trap consists of is, you know, the opening door that closes behind you. There should be some glass there, but put cake in. And so when the water flows through here, you see it's being held back by a piston, it will knock out the torches, which makes the sand fall and the lava spill out. Which, I haven't perfected it exactly, because the lava seems to stop the water right about when it gets... Or the... It doesn't knock out both torches, is what I'm trying to say. And so, I think Captain Sparkles did a version of this trap a while ago, but, you know... Sorry if you hear some sound in the background, um, it's a very noisy day in my house. So pretty much for the redstoning, it's pretty simple, except it has to stretch over a long distance. So you, so here's the dispenser. So pretty much hook it up through here, all the way to this piston, and from here all the way to this piston. And you do actually have to go around. You can't connect it there for some reason. And then when you pull the lever once, it'll open up this, and when you pull it again, the cake will shoot out. So, and then it doesn't let a lot through, so all you have to do is go there, 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 put some lava in, and a touch I just like adding is the paintings to disguise the sand. And then put some glass here so it I'm not sure why, just it helps. I remember there was some complication with it. And um yeah, I mean that's pretty much it for the traps. So if you want to see more of these trap spotlights, uh give a thumbs up. So yeah, Sucker McMango out. Hey there guys, Sucker McMango here. I'm here for the spider. Stop. Sorry.